The Jeju Ole Trail is well marked for safe travel throughout Jeju. It is important to be aware of your personal safety and consider purchasing travel insurance so that you can deal with any unforeseen circumstances that might come along your way. Here are some general guidelines to ensure your personal safety along the Jeju Ole Trails. Number one, complete your walk by 6 p.m. in the summer and 5 p.m. in the winter. Refrain from hiking beyond these hours. Number two, avoid venturing off the trail into steep valleys and cliffs. Number three, if you miss a Jeju Ole Trail sign or waypoint, backtrack to the last known location. Number four, check the distance plate for the remaining distance to your finishing point and verify your current location. This can be done by looking at village and building names. Number five, carry emergency contact at all times. This would be for the Jeju Ole Trail Center as well as the local police. Additionally, during the spring and summer season, mites and mite-related illness can be a problem along the Jeju Ole Trails. Here are some tips that you can use in warm weather to ensure your safety. Number one, wear a long sleeve shirt or arm warmers, long pants, and a wide brimmed hat. Number two, avoid sitting on the ground in grassy areas or near a ranch. Number three, take a shower immediately upon returning to your accommodation. Number four, cleanse the mat or any other equipment that you use with direct contact to the ground. Number five, if you experience a fever or cold-like symptoms after a tick or mite bite, seek proper medical help. Number six, it's generally a good idea to apply insect repellent in advance to prevent any health issues. Remember, if you prepare well, you can have a really positive experience on the Jeju Ole Trails.